Well, hello, boys and girls. It's when I feel I get a clock again. And you're listening to my NHL Pearls of Wisdom. And I am Pearl of Wisdom, aren't I? Yes, I am. Uh, well, yesterday was it was not one of the finest in the land, but we did all right. Took St. Louis to win. And uh, Buffalo, it's time to pack up and go. <laughs> if you if the Buffalo Sabres cannot beat an Ottawa Senators team, which is the bottom of the league almost, on a back-to-back -back after rest in a position where they have to win, they lose 5-2. Now, that being said, Linus Omar decided to do a little jig. In the, I don't know. Go check that out. I don't know what he was doing. It's like he just got that, da -da -da -da, and he fall, falls down and like hurts his leg or something. So they have to put Carter Hutton in net. Now, nobody can predict that, can they? But really, Buffalo didn't look good in that game at all. And I apologize, boys and girls. I hope you didn't listen to my advice on that one, but did with the St. Louis Blues, because that went well. Uh, okay, well, that being said, we, uh, I, I got a few letters here that, or I got a letter and a few comments and a little bit of a surprise for you too. So let's get to her. Uh, Pedro Gonzalez from Mexico. Oh no, sorry. I'll do that after. Let's do Eric Card. Finest program in the land, Eric Card said down in the comment section. Thank you, sir. He also said that he received my letter, an invitation to go to one of our, uh, Pearl of Wisdom Days uh, celebrations next year. And uh, I'm glad you did, sir. I'm glad you're accepting. Uh, it's going to be a wonderful time. Make sure to bring your toga. Okay. And uh, and lube and everything that you need for that sort of thing, for, our, for the festivities. You know what I'm talking about. And your Pearls of Wisdom necklace, of course. Don't forget that like you would. Probably wear it 24 hours a day. I know I do well, except for when I'm doing the videos. I don't like to show off, you know? I don't like to show off. Okay, uh, this check out this shirt I got. Love your neighbor. Love your neighbor. And namaste at the same time. Connecting with the vines, loving our neighbors. That's what we're all about here at Pearls of Wisdom Industries. Okay, what else we got? Uh... Ulysses Hayes said, accept my friend request on Facebook. And uh, that was in the comment section. Thank you, Ulysses. And I did. And I would if you did the same. Just look up Pearl of Wisdom there on the Facebook, the, the, search, the searching engine. And uh, you'll find me and uh, I'll, I'll definitely accept you. I post like rumors and such. And every once in a while, I'll post one of my videos there sometimes. But uh I like to, we like to talk and discuss, mostly, there in the Facebook. Uh, okay, so Pedro Gonzalez now from Mexico. Uh, doesn't say where. I wouldn't probably be able to pronounce it if it does. He says, I uh, joined your Patreon there with uh, B, for BPOW, Brian and I. And uh, I, I would like to, to suggest that maybe you do uh, contests on there. And I think that is one heck of an idea. He also sent me pictures in Mexico. Beautiful, beautiful pictures. Wow, I just love the ocean and uh, all sorts of things. He is a oh, San Jose Sharks fan. That makes sense. Makes sense. Um, so, yes, we are going to do that. That's another reason why you might want to head over there to the uh, Patreon and uh, get yourself the app. Look us up. Be Pal Picks. And uh, we're going to do contests. So we, 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 you can give us suggestions in the comment box. We're coming, we're putting our minds together. But we would really love to have your participation on some contests that we could do there. We're thinking maybe hockey pools. And you're going to make some pearls. You're going to receive pearls for winning the contests and so on and so forth like that. So you're not just throwing some money away at $3 a month or 7 or whatever we decide to do. In fact, we have one for $25 a month. We're going to probably be doing some sales events, a uh, clearance sale. 
for uh, half price for that as well, where you're going to get uh, just everything that your heart desires. Pretty, I'm sure of it. So head over there, take a look. Uh, we'll get the contest going. Help us with what contest we might be able to do if you have any fine contests. Uh, so anyways, with that being said, we should probably get in today's picks. Yeah, let's do that. Uh, Leafs versus the Stars. Yeah, Leafs versus the Stars. No Rupe Rupo hints. That's a fun one to say. Rupo hints. Rup, Ropo. Ropo hints for the Stars. Now, I was leaning the Stars until I found out there was no Ropo hints because they're not really strong up the middle there, those Dallas Stars guys. And uh, we know how it is. It's not fun to be weak in the middle. Not in any way, form, or shape in life. Shape, way, or form? Form, something like that. We Do we want that? Certainly not in hockey. Uh, and the Leafs are very strong in the middle. So as much as I was leaning the stars, but I'm kind of leaning the Leafs now with that information. That's how tight it was on which one I would pick here though. Um, tough game to cap, I would say. Uh, Preds versus the Caps. Now we find out that Saros is in net for the Cap for the Preds. And uh, I don't think Saros is the finest in the land, do you? No. So I'm taking, even Holpe hasn't been either this year, but I have a feeling, I, I just, Caps are at home. Saros has not looked good in any games, really, I've seen this year. So I'm going to go with the Caps here. And I like the over with both of these. Uh, you're pro it's probably six and a half, or five and a, six and a half. I'm not really fond of taking those overs. But if there is a time, this would be the time, I would say. Uh, I believe, I didn't write it down, but I do believe Tampa's taking on LA tonight as well. And... Uh, Doughty is out for Los Angeles. So, yeah. Do I even need to say? I don't think you're getting much juice there. I think you could probably quick be in a net. This would be, uh, I would say this is about as safe a bet as you can get to go uh, on PL for Tampa Bay or in reg, reg. Or, hey, go crazy. Do both. That would be, that would be nutty. And fun. So, yeah, do that. Uh, Flames versus the Oilers. <laughs> well, this is, jeez. Uh, um, let's just, I, I'm, I'm, I'm really not much for doing this now because we have our premium picks that we do here on the Patreon now or our uh, definite picks that we are, by the way, hitting uh, at a very high percentage. Uh, but this is one I would say that I'd likely fade. Because it's going, it, there's so much emotion going on in this game. Uh, I, I, I'm leaning to the Oilers at home. Uh, I just think that uh, Tippett has got the edge in the coaching department for this game. Uh, yeah, I'm going to say Oilers, but probably in overtime, probably like 3 2, something like that. Pretty standard, hard fought game. I would like to see a blowout so we can see a brawl. <laughs> that would be fun. Oh, do I like myself a brawl, don't you? Yes. That's what everybody's hoping for. Let's face it. Everybody's going to watch the Edmonton Oilers, Calgary Flames because of the whole Kachuk Cassian, and we want to see some noggins getting smacked. Right? Right. Say otherwise, you're wrong. You're wrong. Okay. Canucks versus Sharks. Jones in net for the Sharks. That's the big one. Uh, apparently, as uh, uh, Curtis Davis, he's one of the finest in the land. He's commenting down there in the comment section all the time. By the way, our comment section has been fairly light recently. Where is Richie Rich, Ben? Uh, I haven't seen heard Karen Zelansky in a long time. I'm missing you, Karen. We miss you. Oh, I haven't even sent pearls. Because Eric Cart even asked for pearls. I mean, I'll send, send you pearls here after this. But I'm missing you guys. Come come back. Come back to me. Going off 
I, if you, I know Mr. MJ and some of the other finest in the land guys are great and everything. Go visit, but don't leave me. Don't leave me. It hurts down here. It hurts down in here. There, you know where. There. Um, so, anyways, what was I saying? Canucks versus Sharks, right? I got to take the Canucks here. But, oh, yeah, that's what I was saying. Curtis was telling us that the the Canucks have been one in eight or something like that in San Jose. Doesn't sound very promising that way, but we're talking about two different teams here. Uh, the Sharks have been a powerhouse. They are not a powerhouse now, uh, especially with Jones in that. I think Canucks are going to be rocking Markstrom tonight, who has been on fire. So I just have a hard time going away against going away from the Canucks here, and you're almost getting plus money on them. So yeah, I would. I probably would go that way. Oh yes, now we need to talk to uh, Eric Card because you said he was. He said that he uh, was going to be coming to the festivities. So I'm going to get you some Pearl of Wisdom festivity pearls coming your way, and um, I'm also going to send some pearls out to all those that haven't been talking in the comment section anymore to give you a little bit of inspiration to comment down there. Tell me some great contests we can do and all of those sort of things like that. Wow. Ooh, you got a lot of trees in your yard. Wow, Mr. Card. Oh, you're going to have to climb some trees there, buddy. Oh, well. Maybe just let them stay there. Let them shine. Let them twinkle. You got lots all over the ground there, too, so you can pick those up. He's already picking them up. Look at that. He was already ready for me. Ha! <laughs> oh, cool. Okay, and now for the rest of you, Richie Rich and... Uh, Karen Zelansky and uh, who else? There's been lots of guys that haven't been uh, posting down there and uh, it's disappointing. So we're, this is some inspirational pearls for you in my, out of my inspirational basket that Helen made. Oh, Richie, Richie's still got some left over. I'm surprised you haven't used all those up already. Hmm, that's funny. But anyways, there you go, guys. Here's some of that inspiration. Let that sink down into your soul. And uh, remember to love your neighbors. Uh, remember also to uh, head over to the Patreon there. Hit the, and don't, oh, I can't forget. We lift our elbows and we touch the like button and the subscribe so we can grow this community and be the greatest in the land here on the YouTube. And we're going to be the finest in the land there at uh, Patreon. Going to have contests. You guys are going to make money. We're all going to make money. It's going to be wonderful. Have a great day. Lots of love to you.